Hello and welcome to Hypothetical Hypocrite, the channel where I'm a hypocrite but I'm hypothetical about it. My name is Jeremy and here I play video games and just plain try to be entertaining. Uh, here in today's video I'm going to be playing some Undisputed and I'm going to play until I win a match. Uh, I'm not going to make you all have to sit through all the losses and everything like that, but I'm going to at least try to win one. I'm going to go with patience and whatnot to try to win a match but we'll see how things go so let's go ahead and get this game started and see what we can do okay um, do we want to do online or quick fight Let's do online. We're going to do online just for the fun of it. I don't want to do ranked because I just suck that badly. Alright. I want to go with... Uh, No, that's not what I wanted. Let's see if we can find Ward. There he is! Right there. Giotti. Gotti. There he is. This, this is going to be a good match. I like Ward. He, he fought very hard. Even though Gotti won two out of three, he is... He is a battle to be reckoned with. See if we can get somebody to fight us. 20 seconds already. See, everybody wants to fight heavyweight, and, you know, nobody wants to have fun with the flyweights. Or welterweights, I should say. See, nobody wants to play these. I guess we're going to have to go with a different weight. Let's see. Reed, Con, Groves, Brook, Porter, Porter, Rhodes, Rocco. Jones, Jones Jr. Let's go with Alvarez. Canelo. He's a good fighter. He's been in the tops. I just might have to fight a computer computer person I'm not gonna wait forever for people to join a match with me Let's see, I guess we're going to have to go heavyweight. Joe Lewis, Wilder, Frazier, Tyson. I'm going to go with Joe Lewis. See if we can get somebody to battle us now. Otherwise, I'm going against the computer and... We all know how fun that is. The computer always wins. But I'm going to play the long game with the computer. I'm not going to throw a lot of punches. Just try and be an effect, effective fighter.
All right, let's try one more time. Maybe we can get a fight with Ollie. Starting to think this game is very popular and just not that fun. Well, after several tries, that didn't work, so we're going to just do a quick computer map. No, we don't want to quit to that. So we're just going to do a quick fight. Let's go to welterweight. I want to do Ward. Ward versus Gotti. One of the, some of the best fights ever, ever put out there. Ward won one, three, Gotti won two. Well, three, technically, but of the two out of three matches, he won two. Ward is a fighter. He he is a he is a force to be reckoned with. Let's pick an outdoor fight. Let's see if we can handle ourselves against Gotti. The weather couldn't be more perfect. Sunny skies as we get set to rumble here at Empire Fight Camp. My name is Todd Grisham. Next to me, of course, is Johnny Nelson. Todd, always a pleasure to work with you. Always a pleasure. It's time now for our tale of the tape. And introducing first the legend himself, Mickey Ward. He's five foot eight inches tall with a reach of 70.1 inches. He'll be facing Arturo Thunder Gotti, five foot eight inches tall, 147 pounds. We'll be talking about this fight for years to come. Irish Mickey Ward. You've seen all the wars he's been in over his career. Will he give us another one here? Oh, is this his hometown when he's in a totally different country? That doesn't make sense. Arturo Thunder Gotti, the blood and guts his warrior too, for me No too, one has huh? as big a heart as this fighter. They have waited for this fight for so country, long, but still is This is down. ridiculous. Well, Johnny, I agree with you, but this is boxing, as you know, and anything can happen. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the red corner from Lowell, Massachusetts. Hopefully I can Here is the play exciting slow junior and welterweight world title. Maybe get a knockout or a Irish. win. We'll see how it goes. Fighting out of the blue corner, the blood and guts warrior, the Hall of Famer from Jersey City, yep, New Jersey, Gotti, a Gotti. super lightweight champion Great of the world, fighter. Arturo Thunder Gotti. Well, I hope you brought your sunglasses because we're fighting outside and what a main event this should be. The heat of the crowd, the action, the noise, that carnival atmosphere, it's a lot to take in. Good luck. Let's do this. Many said this fight would never happen, and yet here it is, and here we go. Good counter punching for both these fighters. There's a counter shot. Nice counter shot with the right hand. He gets out of the way of that left hand. Oh, 
perfect punch. That punch landed. Oh, look at Gotti. I don't know if he's going to survive. Can he get out of this predicament? Didn't wait too long to get back and get engaged. Gage some both men in this round. This counter puncher is going to wait for you to move first, and then, this is not the way he wanted this fight to start. Let's see if he can get out of trouble. Oh, that changes everything! Oh, he there took me go. down in the first round already. And I hate five, this. Two, three, four, five. I hate this knockout or knockdown setup, too. Boom, I'm not doing good at, yeah, he's 100% stamina, I'm at 82, I, uh, I'm, I don't think I'm going to last this one. Is going to wait for you to move. He's got to do something. I thought that was. As he weathered the storm, it appears that the moment of trouble has passed, at least for now. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. It's bombs away. Oh, look at Gotti. I don't know if he's going to survive. How is he still on his feet? I don't believe. Got him. Got him. One, two, three, He'll get up four, quick, though. It's his first five, knockdown. Six, seven, eight. Ooh, he was slow to get up. Final 10 seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. So it's plan B time after being knocked down in that round. I love the oh God, he's not looking good for health. Let's let's see what we can do here. Caution being thrown to the wind. Can Arturo Gotti survive this storm? Nice. See if we can get to, uh, get a win on this one. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, I'm expending a lot of stamina just seven, just eight, for this. Nine. Oh, nine. Let's see if we can if we can keep this up. And down goes Gotti. Oh, goes down quick. Nine, 
My first win. Awesome. Hooray. So it's onward and upward after another knockout win here. A knockout victory. Word against Gotti. Did you see the shot? That's not a knockout. That's an assassination. I think that's what how it shot. worked in the first game, in the first matches. Ward won one, and Gotti won the next two. Nice. Nice. Can't beat that. Good game. Good game. Let's do a rematch. See what it looks like on the rematch side. See if I can do it again. I'm Todd Grisham. The crowd cannot wait to witness this one. There's nothing quite like a fight at. All right, we're gonna first, skip through this Irish a little bit. Mickey Ward. Mickey Ward. If you're looking for heart, courage, and determination, this is your guy. One of the toughest fighters that's ever laced him up. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the Let's red go. corner, from Lowell, Massachusetts, here is the exciting junior welterweight He's world title. Introduced. So let's an open air the, outdoor oh, stadium. What a venue for this it contest. Both. Todd is one of my I favorite didn't even venues. realize that. You can't get a better place to fight. I want you to protect yourself at all times. And what I say you must obey. Good luck. High hopes for this battle between these two athletes. Defending. Catch and oh, and Gotti gets clipped. Arturo Gotti in trouble. He's been in this situation many times before, but I don't know if he's going to find a way out. Well, he's showing us he's got an iron chin, but at what cost? He's got to think about his future. He gets clipped. Arturo Gotti in trouble. He's been in this situation many times before, but I don't know if he's going to find a way out. Can he get out? Oh, and that big shot got Arturo Gotti. He's wobbly. He stumped, and that will put Gotti got down. Got him. First round. Can we win two out of three? three four, five. Oh, he got up quick. He got up on five. Took a right, took a big right. One, two, Is he not going to get up? Oh, two knockdowns first round. He got up at eight. Let's do this. Some iconic Nicky Ward and Gotti fights. He'd rather forget. Ooh, he made it to the second round. Back to the corner, but he's still in it. Unbelievable heart knocked down twice. I can't believe my health and my stamina are doing so well. Well, we've just taken a big breath, and here we go again. Back to life now, starting to land. Whoa, and you saw the balance go. The knees, the foundation, rocked. I don't believe what we're seeing here. Oh, my word, God, he just got caught. As he 
weathered the storm. That was the moment. This is a high octane battle. Come on. Get your stamina back up. Come on. A counterfighter relies a lot on their instincts and reaction time. You've got to get in there quick to punch your opponent. This is not the way he wanted this fight to start. Let's see if he can. And they're down, running out of Ooh, time. Oh, he took a few shots as he was going down. One, two, three, four. And Mickey's considered the, the weaker of the two. Knockout in the second round again. Woo. So time to go celebrate after another knockout win here. A knockout victory. That's not a knockout victory. That is somebody saying, I'm here. We don't have to go two out of three because we won twice in a row. Nice. And God, he's considered the better fighter. Nice. All right, and I think we're going to end it there, where I'm a winner. Two out of three matches, Ward versus Gotti. That didn't happen in real life. It was Gotti two out of three in, the, in their actual real life matches, but I changed that, which is awesome. And I hope you guys enjoyed that. So if you did, uh, stick around to the end and see both fights and enjoyed it please hit that like button leave a comment subscribe if you do subscribe hit that notification bell so you can be notified of all my posts and my videos and everything like that and most importantly share share it to your friends and family and whoever might be entertained by this kind of content it's very welcomed and appreciated and with that being said, I hope y'all have a good one, and I'll see you in the next video.